to see if I can get any useful uh, video using light weights because it's my rest day and I don't want to go heavy. But the starting position and hip height. I'll see what happens here. Okay, so get my feet in here, bar over midfoot, and then reach down and grab the bar and bend your legs. My knees have come to the front of my arms. My hips went down exactly that far. I didn't go I didn't go further down cuz that's going to make me then have to rise until my shoulders come over the bar. The bar can't lift until the shoulder joints and the bar are aligned, just like a crane cable is going to pick something up. It's not going to pick it up like that or it's going to swing. And when you swing from the top, because the load's not going to swing. So the hips come to where they're supposed to be. The bar's over the midfoot. You grab, you bend the knees. The shins touch the bar, but really the knees dictate pretty much because you're bending the knees. And the hips come down as you do that, and they stop. The shins touch the bar, knees at the front elbows. The hips travel down exactly the amount that they needed to to make those two things happen. So you're not putting your hips anywhere with your brain, really, almost. You, you start, bar over midfoot, grab, bend, and your hips are at the right position. Now, the pre-pull is here. Shoulders get pulled long. You're putting effort in with your legs. Hips aren't really moving. And then when my quad's just tired out, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to bend down, grab the bar, bend my knees, hips will be at the right position. I'm going to pull my arms long, pull the slack out of my arms and of the bar, out of the whole system. And then I want everything to rise together. I want my head to go straight up, shoulders straight up. Then the Free pull right there, so it's like you, know, it's just, you pull a little bit, you take some of the weight straight up, shoulders, hips, back, everything together. So you got pull right there, the shoulders come down, the slack comes out, your hips are in position. That's it. If your proportions are different and you bend and your correct position is somehow with the hips this high, of course that puts my shoulders forward because of my, but if, if, if you do the bar over midfoot and you bend and your hips are high but they don't shoot and it brings you to the correct position I described, then that's your hip starting position. Mine is pretty, pretty low. I mean, I start pretty squatty. I think there's probably some people that start even lower, but it's just dependent on that.